My name is Diego Uriel Flores Arroyo. I'm a poet, artist, and musician here in Denver, presenting this new play, Quack de Moxin, at MCA Denver Holiday Theater. Yeah, I was born and raised in North Denver. Um, really thankful to be um, having it at the theater. Uh, Denver is right in the middle of everything. I think that that is really beautiful, you know, seeing all these different languages come here, all these different people. What would you like to see more from Denver? Mm. Supporting the roots of where it came from, you know, a lot of uh, what Denver was built off of is, uh, artistically at least, is like a DIY, you know, we weren't always LA and we weren't always New York. Supporting those grassroots movements uh, to supporting youth artists, you know, and I think that that's, that's how we keep the, the Denver art movement strong, you know, is investing in our youth. I always knew I was an artist, but I, it took uh, mentors along the way to really encourage me to go down that path. Um, the path of an artist is not easy, but it's fulfilling. Guactemoxin has been quite a ride. Uh, it originally started as an idea walking through uh, Chicago. I just felt like I was at home. You know, I felt like I was walking in my neighborhood, like feeling uh, like the music happening, the, the Mexican music specifically, like the, and so just kind of feeling the, the roots of um, the ancestry present, you know. I will always be looking through a brown lens. And so I, I feel like as, as an artist, it's my duty to talk about what's happening around me and how I feel about it. But um, I just cannot remove that brown lens. So it's just something that I, I have to walk with, you know, and uh, present as such, you know. But I want to make it in a way where people from a different perspective are able to feel the emotions that I feel and understand that I'm existing in that way, you know. Art is a reflection of life, and in that we need to be honest with our reflection of life. Um, there's a lot of feelings that we uh, don't even acknowledge, and when we acknowledge those things and are able to talk about them, then uh, people are able to connect with them that much more. It's our job as artists to uh, personify those feelings and uh, put them in a way that people can digest their own um, understandings of themselves. Playwriting is a unique form of expression because it's using the fourth dimension, painting in the fourth dimension, uh, using space and time. Overall intention is big, but uh, storytelling in this way can be really impactful because uh, it's a reflection of life to the T if you, if you do it right.